thank you for joining me and welcome back to the channel so today guys it's not gonna be a long video I did make a few purchases and I wanted to share those with you today um, they're black owned businesses so you may already know about these companies but I just wanted to share what I picked up from them one is called Southern Elegance candles and the other is Jackie Ina's forever mood candles and I'm also going to be sharing with you a couple of fragrances that were sent to me by dossier so I'm going to start with the perfumes guys and the perfume again is by Dossier and this is the packaging that it comes in guys. It's a plain cardboard box. No, no frills, nothing like that guys. Um, this is what it looks like when you open the box and you purchase it. It says iconic sense, designer quality, no markups. And inside the box you get a description card and the fragrance that inspired it. In this case, this is called Woody Chestnut. And it is inspired by Maison Margiela Replica by the Fireplace, Eau de Parfum. And with Dossier, guys, they have a no risks policy. And the policy uh, says that you can buy a perfume, sample it, and you can decide within 30 days if you like it or you don't like it. If you sample it and you don't like it, you simply just place it back in the box, send it back to the company for a full refund. And I have my sample of the original. The inspiration is Replica. Maison Margiela replica by the fireplace. So right here, I'm just going to spray the woody chestnut right here on my hand. Let me just bring it down here. And I'm going to spray in the inside of my arm. Oh guys, it smells so nice. Let me just fan it down a little bit. They both have a nice sweet fragrance. Although I think replica smells a little more sweeter. And the woody chestnut is definitely more woody at the top. I like to wear light floral fragrances in the spring and summer and early fall. But this is definitely something that just smells rich and sophisticated. And you would, I would definitely be wearing this in the fall. This smells really good, guys. Woody chestnut. This is really good. It has a nice warm smell to it. Just warm. Smell some vanilla. This smells really nice, guys. I really love this. I'm going to leave this out. I'm going to wear this later. Okay, guys. So, the next fragrance is called Fruity Magnolia. And Fruity Magnolia gets its inspiration from Versace Bright Crystal. And Fruity Magnolia. Oh, it smells so good, guys. It smells good already. I can smell it. It smells nice. And it smells very similar. This is my travel size of Versace's Bright Crystal. They smell all pretty. They smell the same. I don't even have to spray this, guys. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to spray it, but I'm telling you right now, it's the same. So I'm going to spray the Fruity Magnolia up here. And this is the roller ball, so I'm just going to roll it in the inner portion of my arm here. And I'm going to let that dry down for a few seconds. This smells so nice. This is definitely my type of fragrance. Very light, a floral, fruity. It smells very pretty. This is very yes, guys. This smells very, very similar. Definitely the pomegranate scent is at the top. That um, sweet, but like tangy-like scent is right up at the top. I smell jasmine. Definitely smell rose in this, guys. This is so nice. This is so beautiful. Pomegranate, rose. A little bit of musk maybe. I think I'm smelling some kind of musk as they both dry down. They're smelling very similar. They both dry down very, very quickly. Very, very quickly. This is a very lovely fragrance. This smells really nice. It smells pretty. It smells light. It's floral. The pomegranate gives it that little tang fruitiness. That's right at the top. I smell that right at the top. And uh, this is really nice. I tried this out the other day. I found that this lasted longer on my skin than the original so I just wanted to let you know keep that in mind that the staying power on this one is really long I think I got eight hours off of this anyway guys so that is it for dossier check that out if you're interested but anyway guys that is going to be it and uh, yeah I'm gonna just get on with the rest of the video okay guys so the next thing I'm gonna share with you are some candles that I picked up from a black owned company called Southern Elegance and this is what their candles look like. I picked up three of them. I want to show you the other ones. Let me just reach over here and get them. I've got 
three of their candles. I don't want to break anything. They come in these like mason type jars. They're really heavy, guys. You get a lot of candle. Um, the scents are really good. They're not uh, mild or very overly bold where you would have to like not burn them for long periods of time. Now, guys, I know I had said to you once before that uh, I think it was a couple years ago that I wasn't going to burn candles anymore. I was into using wax melts. And um, be, to be honest, guys, I actually miss burning candles. I just miss the constant fragrance that's, you know, the warmness of the fragrance that moves around my home. Plus, I miss the glow of the candle. So anyway, these candles that I got are soy candles, and they have uh, lots of fragrance in it, and it just they just smell so beautiful. One of the things I liked about this candle company, and guys, they have loads of candles. They have lots of candles. Uh, some of them have really clever names, and those are the ones that I focused on when I was shopping. They have different sized candles. They also have uh, wax melts also, and they also sell candles in like small little tins, like, you know, like this size. But anyway. I was interested in the larger candles. I'm always interested in larger candles. But what drew me to these candles were the funny sayings that they had. And so I just picked up three of them and I want to, so I'm going to share them with you. And I'm going to share what scents they have. So the first candle is called The Lord Knows My Heart. And The Lord Knows My Heart is a tobacco and caramel scented candle or caramel scented candle. And ooh, it's hard to open. And again, guys, this smells so nice. You, this one has two scents. I definitely smell the caramel at the top along with the mild tobacco smell. Oh, this smells so nice. And this one is called The Lord Knows My Heart. Really, really nice. Oh, this smells so nice and warm. The next candle is called Jesus Be a Fence. Jesus be a fence. So the first one is the Lord knows my heart. This one says Jesus be a fence. And let me open it. Oh, it smells really nice. This this is honeysuckle and jasmine. It smells very floral. It has a nice floral smell. Yeah. Nice, pretty, light floral smell. Honeysuckle and jasmine. Really, really nice. I've had these candles now for about a week two weeks maybe going on two weeks and I just couldn't help myself I just wanted to burn one of them and this last one that I picked up from them is called get behind me Satan get behind me Satan and this candle is a blend of pineapple and sage and guys I love the way this smells you definitely can smell the pineapple slight sweetness and it has that greenness that green leafiness at the base which which is the sage and I think the, these candle sizes are really big guys so I've burned this candle twice uh, a total of 12 hours two separate days six hours each day and I want you to see how much of the candle has gone down hardly anything guys 12 hours it's gone off this candle so just to show give you a comparison so these candles burn long and they burn slowly and what I've been doing, I've been using my um, candle chimneys for this. I think I have one behind me. You guys have seen me use them. The candle chimney, guys, helps the candle to burn longer and slower. It just blocks a lot of the oxygen that helps, you know, just fan your flame of your candle and allows your candle to burn very quickly. This will block that oxygen and help your candle to burn evenly and slowly and so that's why I use them and it also helps to um, help your scent rise and disperse throughout the room I love them so and I've been using this with the candle and I have burnt this candle a total of 12 hours and as you can see how much is left it looks like it's still filled but anyway this is called get behind me Satan so I'm going to move right into the Jackie Ina candles, which is called Forever Mood. This is a sampler that I picked up from Sephora because I got a little bit of a discount there. I just used some points. I applied my points to my purchase and I just wanted to pick up some of her candles. So this is called Forever Mood. The name of this sampler is called Open to Get Lit. And that's where it says Forever Mood. And this, in the back it says send a mood collection All right send moods collection sorry about that guys and let me show you what it says in the inside 
This box is a magnetic box, guys. This would make a great gift for someone who likes candles. Now, guys, I can tell you from opening this, this smells um, very cinnamon-like. Cinnamon, I smell uh, sagey. It smells like um, nutmeg. It smells like the holiday a little bit. So inside the box, it says, in your kitchen, in your bedroom, or in your bathroom, you decide. If you like candles that remind you of the holidays, like Thanksgiving, Christmas, or maybe even as early as Halloween, the Halloween season, late October, you would like this. Guys, look how pretty this looks. Look how pretty that looks. I'm not going to take them out, all of them out, because I just want to show you the size of the candle in relationship to my hand. So that's what you get. And this one, they smell so good, guys, but they definitely remind me of the holiday. All those scents and smells and those seasonings that you might use to cook with and during the holiday. Cinnamon and clove and um, nutmeg. This, these candles remind me of that. So I'm just going to just show you what they say in the inside. And this one says, We Not Lincoln. We Not Lincoln. The next one says, Grown Folks Business. The third one says, Hey, Big Head. And this last one, let me just turn it around. This last one says, Skinny Dipped. And this is really nice, guys. It smells good. And again, I think I would probably start using these in October. Yeah, late October, I would probably use this. It just has that scent to me. It just smells like the holiday. Okay, guys, I have two more candles by um, Forever Mood. And I'm just going to go through those very quickly with you. Uh, this first one is called Left on Red. And Left on Red. The candles look really nice, guys. They have a nice statement to them. Beautiful lavender-like container. The top is gold. Well, not gold, like a brassy color. And, oh, it smells so nice, guys. This smells sweet and it smells light. A little bit of floral. Let me read to you very quickly on the box if there's any information I can share with you. This left on red, a top note, a tropical fruit, heart note, coconut and coconut milk. Base is caramel. This says this is a 10 ounce candle, burn time up to 65 hours. 100% natural soy wax candle, and the scent throw is moderate. And it definitely does smell mild, guys, so it's not a strong fragrance, not at all, but it does smell very good. And the last one, guys, is called Caked Up. Caked Up. Let's see what that smells like. Caked Up. Nice container, guys. I like this shade of pink. It's not really pinky pink. It's like a nice... Maybe nude shade of pink. Oh, but guys, this smells so good. I can smell this already. Oh, this is the top. That's what it looks like inside. It has a little bit of a rubber gasket. So that I guess the top fits nice and snug. And this smells so, so good, guys. This smells like something sweet, like cake or uh, cupcakes. It has that scent like when you go to the bakery and you smell cake and cupcakes and cookies. That cake scent, this smells just like that. This smells so good. The scent details are top note are roasted pistachio, almond cream, and pineapple. Heart notes are honey, jasmine, and coconut. Base note is vanilla bean and musk. And it says it is a 10 ounce candle, burnt up to 65 hours. Natural soy wax candle, and the scent throw is bold. So that means this will get a nice good scent from this, and maybe it could um, scent a few rooms in your home as you burn it. But anyway, oh, it smells so good, guys. So good. It smells like food. It smells really like food. Yeah, guys. So let me set that there. So guys, that is it for the candles. Yeah, no. These are two black-owned businesses I was just showing love to, and I absolutely love their product. I'm so glad that I love everything that I have got. But anyway, guys, I want to thank you all so much for joining me today. I do appreciate it. And uh, yeah, guys, so stay well, stay safe, and stay blessed, and I will see you at the next video. Bye-bye.